Senator Chuck Schumer and the GOP have a lot of disagreements, but nothing has created quite the firestorm like the one over Zinn nicotine patches. Griff Jenkins has more. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer is once again at odds with his Republican colleagues as he launches a new mission to ban these. They're called Zen, nicotine alternative pouches popular with young people. There have been some warning signs that its use is spreading to those under 17, and it's also feared it could be acting as a gateway drug. Now Schumer is waging war on Zen, comparing it to the fight against e-cigarettes and claiming tobacco companies are trying to hook kids for life. Our schools have been, had been inundated with e -cigarettes and we took action seeking federal results. Zinn is the next battle and the feds must be ready. But the bipartisan backlash has been swift. Some members of Schumer's own party, like Democrat John Fetterman says, Americans should be allowed to decide on their own, while Republicans see the proposed ban as another big government power grab and say Schumer's priorities aren't where they should be. If Schumer is so worried about teenagers, why don't you close the border? 110,000 per year of, uh, of Americans of our fellow citizens, and many of them teenagers, are dying of fentanyl overdoses. Meanwhile, it's still not clear where the White House stands. Press Secretary Corinne Jean-Pierre was asked about it on Wednesday, but referred all questions to the FDA. That's something for FDA to speak to. I can't speak to that from here. Zinn's parent company, Philip Morris International, issued a statement to Fox saying they fully meet industry regulations and do not market their products to children. In Washington, Griff Jenkins, Fox 32, Chicago.